Shipyard is important to keep the boat afloat and to keep it safe. It's a steel hulled boat and uh, we really have to stay on top of things and that's what we've been doing this period. We've had help from many quarters, from many countries, including Canada and, and England. Welcome to Egina. Just picking up some spare parts and it's been a great blessing to be able to build relationships with shop owners and be able to share price with them. We are in the Planaco shipyard. Every three years the boat comes out for, for maintenance. Behind me, everything inside and outside the boat in the red section has been uh, thoroughly attacked and worked on from piping to anti-fouling. Just uh, doing what has to be done in detail. Sanding, painting, and keeping the ship in good working order as far as the outside of the hull and keeping all the nice, beautiful stainless steel in good shape. On the inside, we've been focusing on the electrical upgrade that we have done uh, to Morningstar and just checking things, renewing uh, some of the connections and making sure everything's working in proper order, installing some new uh, equipment. So safety is uh, really important. Regular maintenance has to take place uh, in the background. So we're just uh, going over stuff in detail, painting the bilge here, making sure that the plates are good and just changing a lot of things that needed changing. Besides uh, work on the shipyard, we've had a great opportunity in order to uh, share Christ with workers here on the yard and build relationships with them, and that's been great. We're on the last stretch of our shipyard time, and we just have to button up the boat, putting back hardware, propellers, transmission, uh, piping, and painting, and uh, then we should be done soon. So pray for us that we will be on time, on schedule. Uh, beginning of June is when we want to get back in the water, and just pray for fruitfulness this summer, and uh, for the remaining of the year, that God will really, really use us to touch the lives of, uh, of the unsaved, but also to encourage uh, many of the believers. Pray for the believers on this island and other islands too, that we can be an encouragement to them as we visit them. Pray that we'd be sons of encouragement like Barnabas in the book of Acts.